Hey everyone, my name is Ty Jankowski, and in this video, we are going to look at how to install my solar system digital asset for Houdini. You can get the solar system digital asset on my Gumroad, gumroad.com. There'll be a link in the description. Uh, you can also grab it on my Linktree, linktree.trzank. Oh, cool. So once you have the solar system HTA downloaded, purchased up, you will receive a delivery package, a directory, or a folder, a zip file containing uh, the following. You'll get the EULA uh, saying what you know you should and can't do in terms of use, all that fun stuff. Then there's the all important HDA, and this is what you'll install to your Houdini configuration. Then there are modules for uh, Python 2.7 and Python 3.7, uh, depending on your configuration. And uh, then these are all the textures, lovely textures for the solar system. So uh, I would first recommend reading the readme install. Uh, this is going to have written instructions as well as a pointer link to uh, where you can find the purchase installation, uh, any other helper files, and my YouTube video for all the my YouTube for all the videos in relation to this asset and some of the other stuff that I'm working on and create. And it's really quite simple. It's pretty much three steps, four steps if you count just having fun. And the first step is simply, you need to sign up for GeoNames. Now, GeoNames is an API which allows you to basically say, like just type in a, a address or city or just you know location, and it configures the entire solar system to this location. And to do that, you have to go to geonames.org.login which, oops, looks like this. Geonames. Feels like a little old school of a website, but it's actually extremely powerful, all that they offer. And just do the kind of, uh, you know, create account, go through all the confirm email fun stuff. After you've done that, remember to come back to geonames.login log in with your username and password, and then you will get a little button that says uh, enable API access. And so you'll wanna click that. I can't do that, I already have an account. So there you go. Username, password, if you have any issues, please email me or just, it's not so bad to, to figure it out. Make sure you have a unique username. Uh, you can have it be you know your standard username or anything new. Um, Second step to installation is kind of a pretty classic Houdini HDA installation uh, step, which is to just set up some Houdini environment variables. And depending on your operating system, remember to uh, make sure the slashes are all, like the, like the forward and backslashes are all in the correct direction. This is where you'll put your username, the same username that you use to create your account into Solar System Geonames username in your Houdini environment file, which is under your Houdini installation and your system user preferences, or perhaps in a, a site location. After that, just remember to put the last either forward or backslash, depending on your operating system, as I'm simply concatenate this path and the texture paths to build the paths for uh, the solar system that you can actually see the textures on the planets. Then it's just a really straightforward install the .hda file, classic Houdini install. Uh, if you're just a single user, you can pretty much put it in your Houdini uh, user preference directory, which you can discover by typing this env into a Houdini Python shell. So for me, that's here. Great. And then slash OTLs is where you will put the solar system HDA file is where you will put this file. After that, you'll have to restart Houdini. 
and then Solar System HTA will install. If you have any problems, for example, uh, texture path isn't available, anything else isn't available, you'll get warnings above uh, this location and below the presets directory. Uh, but once you have everything going, just you know, confirm by throwing down the solar system and going to, I like to go to the moon cam. It'll put us in the moon cam. And we'll see that this is the what the moon looks like from Berlin at this specific date and time. You can confirm that by looking at the time and date website, Berlin, Germany, moonrise, moonset. And that moon right there, which, you know, if I refresh, looks like that moon. I might have to refresh by framing forward framing backwards, but no, yeah, there we go. Going back into the moon cam, and there we are. That is the, more or less, the basis of installing the solar system HTA. Should you have any questions or comments, please feel free to email me at trzankofx at gmail.com. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe for more. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.